Cool. Hello everyone. So we have this video from Dave, even though it's hard to see <laughs> that in Dave the sun was like towards us and it was pretty hard to like record. But yeah, Dave, that's you. Trust me. And yes, we're gonna review it real quick. And it's, again, it's from Saturday, so it's at higher rates. Um, I'm not sure what rate where you're going exactly. I'll have to play it. And yeah, let's take a look at it. Normal speed. Good. So first things first, Dave. Um, yesterday you did a good improvement with the digging of the blade, but look at here how deep they go, how deep they go, how high your hands go, and how much water is there in your in your ore. Look, it's insane, and it's like almost like the ore lock is in the water. So it's something that we need to start working on again. Yesterday looks looked like um, you were working on it, so great job. But um, our next step is trying to get confident enough to bring it to the high rates. So let's go to the finish. Mm, one thing I told you is that when you do um, pieces, seems that you forget to do body over. Look here, I'm going to try to zoom it in a little more. Look here, how? Hands go away. The body is not over, the body is not prepared, and the knees are going up. Looks like you're doing everything at the same time, and it's a little chaotic. It looks like you're doing everything um, deorganized. So I really try to work on that even when we're going at higher rates, okay? Hands away, body over, and then the knees up. We're gonna go to the catch. First things first. Your anticipation again, it's a little too late. You're waiting till last minute to roll up. And your hands do an interesting movement towards the catch. So you're keeping your legs, um, your legs, sorry, um, your arms straight, 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 good, flat in the water. And then when you're here, you bring them up, then back down. So it's a weird movement. Let's see if I can explain it better. So you're going low, low, up. So you have them normal. Then you bring them lower and then up. And I want you to take a look at your plate. How much water are you splashing? Look, the backsplash, it looks cool, but it's useless. Um, I'll tell you right now that if you, that you see a backsplash, a backsplash in a picture or in a video, that's not a good sign, even though it looks super cool. But again, um, let's try to avoid it, okay? How do we avoid that? Trying to keep um, the, the the hands at the same level all the time. And also making sure that we anticipate early and we are aware of what um, our plate work is doing. This one, um, this one in starboard sides looks a little better, but again, it kind of looks pretty light. But yeah, it seems like it's needed a little, let's zoom it out a little. It's a little uneven. I don't know if it's me. Just woke up from a nap. Now it looks like starboard uh, squares up a little earlier. Then again, when you are in the catch, your hands go up, up, and you do the rainbow. So your your um your plates go in deep, and then you bring your leg, your arms down again from the catch. You place, and instead of keeping a straight line, you're going up, 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 up 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 and then low so that's the rainbow that we were talking about okay we you've seen it in some other videos of some other people and yeah instead of that i want you to do a straight line like this and not like this make sense i'm an artist i want to make it clear good um let's take a look at the catch again place again the backsplash is not a good sign that means that um, you're just dragging the blades around the water all the time and then at the end instead of getting ready for a good anticipation you're just dragging them till the end and you splash water 
the shoulders look a little tense the one on the one on the starboard side looks a little worse oh that's a fancy uh, um, look a little worse I don't know if you can see it's up a little too much so you have to make sure to relax okay the shoulders we've chat about it in the past and your body goes straight up and down so up and down there's no preparation and there's no sending with the body so when you catch legs go down you should lay back a little more and sand not super lay, not super like um how do i say it not a super weird lay back that it's like leaving laying, laying back like if we were sweeping rowing more like of you when you bring your legs down when the legs down before the arms go in, you open the body a little Be um, when the legs go down, okay? So the legs go down, arms straight, you should open your body a little to sand the boat. Not Again, no, don't exaggerate it too much, but something that should be visible because you seem like you're going up and down, up and down in a straight position and there's no hip movement, there's no body over preparation. Things that, um, something um, that I've seen that you don't do during pieces, but your body overlooks way better um, during steady state the times I've seen you. So again, it's just practicing and making sure that we're confident enough to, to do the same on higher weights, okay? And the backsplash, again, we need to be more consistent with it. We need to be more consistent with the height of our hands, so we've got this huge backs backsplash. You're basically sending and your plates look at this position clock you're not giving enough anticipation your plates are not square on the water so you basically like put them on the square on the water and that's why we get so much backsplash so next time remember about half slide half feather around here the plate should be at half feather and the plate should be square and ready to go in sharp and quick something else the timing let's play normal how the timing looks like um your blade book your, your stroke looks a little short let's figure it again it looks a little too short basically because of the things that we talked about um you add no body on the stroke you don't uh, you rush to do hands away body over and legs you're rushing to do that so please be conscious about organizing everything and then it's going to be easier to get a better ratio and a better rate okay but again yesterday it was a it was something really different so you look way better but let's keep thinking about that 